Water and poo, water and poo. I'm gonna tell you how we manage our water and poo. In an eco-friendly way, yes, that's how we like to play. Dairy farmers know how to manage their water and poo. Now out in pasture is where our cows typically reside, but we have to catch what they drop when they're inside. So we've got traps to collect their urine and their crap. And that's our first step towards managing water and poo. Da dum 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 now spread and slurry. It ain't a daily chore, we've got a big tank in which we keep it stored until we can fly it on our land in accordance with a nutrient management plan which said today it was perfect for spreading water and poo. Water and poo, water and poo, I'm telling you how we spread our water and poo in an eco-friendly way yes that's how we like to play dairy farmers know how to spread their water and poo now when it's warm we put it on bermuda grass but when it cools off other crops start growing fast fescue and oats are two that benefit the most from the nutrients found in our water and poo da -dum -dum -dum. now you might be thinking Man, that stuff must really stink. But the odor is not what you would think. We manage it well, which makes it very hard to tell with your nose that we even have any water or poo. Water and poo, water and poo. I'm telling you how we manage our water and poo in an eco-friendly way yes that's how we like to play dairy farmers know how to manage their water and poo dairy farmers responsibly manage their water and poo hi i'm will gilmer of gilmer dairy farm to learn more about how we care for our environment our animals and our community visit www.gilmerdairyfarm.com Thank you for your continued support of America's dairy farm families and have a dairy good day.